Hey kids, Al Carroll, CEO of Explore DE. Welcome to this episode of Showtime Showcase with Dream, where we're going to find out what happened to our comedy competition and will Joel be Dream's new stepdaddy? Find out on this episode of Showtime Showcase with Dream. <laughs> All right, all right, man. Come on, man. Y'all make some noise, baby. Y'all know what time it is. Y'all know what time it is. We are back, baby. We are back. Season four. Season four. Season four, man. Showtime. Showcase. Man, man. With your boy Dream and my homeboy, Just Joe No T. Yeah, we're back. Man, sponsored by Colonial Motors, Inc. You want to catch them at colonialinc.com. Ain't that right, so? That's absolutely right. We got special guests at the table, too. Who we got at the table, Joe? We got the one and only, Miss The one and only. Fires the Fozz. The Fozz. Not to be mistaken hey. by hey. the Fozz. Hey. The Fozz. The so, Fozz. Sort of like Waka Waka. Yes. Right? We got Rico Malley. He's worth a thousand words. Pavarazzi <laughs> to the stars. He'll make you famous, ladies and gentlemen. Man. Mirage no photography. No doubt. Rico. How you doing, my friend? What's up, guys? All right, How man. Was, why don't you tell me good. about your website? What you doing? Why you do it better than Is anyone it? else, man? Hey man, hey! I just like making people look good and feel good. That's got to admit, you do. Uh, yes, you do I it well. Got friends of my mom's calling me, man. Mm, I you do it well. About, shoot, shoot just about anything and anybody. Uh, you can see my work at miragephotography.com. dot com. That's Mirage Photography with an F. So that's F O T O G R A P H Y. Yes. Check me out. Uh, you can look me up on Facebook, uh, Instagram, miragephotography.com. dot com pretty recognizable it's a woman's behind with an American flag painted on it so <laughs> good stuff yeah man he's the only guy that does more headshots than a prostitute I'm telling you <laughs> yo you see, you, see, you see the gear he got he got like oh four. yeah Tell oh me, yeah look you might you might want to hire this guy on top yeah. of it you, to go stalk somebody yeah. and take pictures for you, man, or check up on your uh, significant other. I did other. used to do some uh, private uh, yeah, detective work. Wait, is it, is it private? Yeah, private detective. Private right? dick? Is that what they call <laughs> it? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> private dick. That's pretty good. That's, yeah, that's pretty another good. topic for our other show. <laughs> I, I'm sorry. I didn't know how clean we were trying to keep this tonight. <laughs> hey, man, it's the podcast, man. You know how we do it, man. But listen, we're here, man. Season four. We're getting ready for season four. You know, we had a little uh, slight... A hiatus, uh, if you will. a little slight will. hiatus, right? right? Right. So what we're going to do tonight, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to have a knee slapper recapper. We're going <laughs> to talk about all the previous seasons and what the highlight moments for each one of us was. Absolutely. Absolutely. And uh, I'm going to have to say one of the highlights of the last three seasons is Dylan Tucker, man. And the fact that he won... Three. Three of our events, man. Yep. And he's going yep. on. Dylan Tucker, shout out to Dylan Tucker, man. And and if you know what we do, we promote comics. And you know, we got these shirts that say famous enough, That's which it. you can purchase through uh tell us about the uh Yeah, famous enough you can be, you can purchase that right through Dreamland Entertainment. And uh send us your size and colors, we make sure we do that. <laughs> you can go to on uh Dream. 9845 at gmail.com to purchase those. But as my as Joe was mentioning, we are trying to recap. We're going to recap because uh, season four, we had a little minor setback. For those listeners, who, or those who are out there who follow us, you know that we were having our comedy competition uh, for season four at the House of Laughs. But there's just been a slight delay in that. But the show must go on, as they say. And we may not be at the House of Laughs, but we are in the house laughing here at our podcast right. that we call... Mm-hmm. Yes, yes, yes. So come on down to the yes, show, yes. man. And that's what I'm getting back to with these t-shirts, man. We'll make you famous enough. Dylan Tucker, three seasons he won. Went on to play the Apollo Theater. Yes, he did. If you follow Explore DE, you would have seen the marquee right there in New York. Dylan Tucker, Apollo. Shout out to my boy Dylan Tucker. People are going places. Going places, man. Quite quite a few quite a few of the uh, comedians that have... Uh, that we have showcased here through the uh, comedy competitions. I think we started back uh, right right after the pandemic. We're doing the pandemic, right? It was April, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We great. We was at the Boulevard, then we went from the Boulevard up to uh, Taste New York, right? Yeah, in Smyrna. Then we uh, went up to the House of the Absent Women, and it's been great. Each season has gotten better and better, right? The first season within itself had a hundred and fifty six episodes. Wow! Wow! Wow. And it, ju- it just got better from there. Right. 
That's more than Chico and the Man. I remember that. Right. Mm-hmm. <laughs> exactly. and, 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 you know, I peaked at st- statistics. Yeah. We're worldwide. Yeah, man. Doing a great job, man. We had a great team. Uh, you know, Marky Mark, you know what I mean? We call him the show. He is the man. You know what I mean? We got my man Rico who's sitting here. Foz is our administrative queen, you know what I mean? And one and only the CEO, you know, that holds it all down is the one and only Five Mouth Al Carroll is in the building as well, man. Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. I'm here. CEO, what's going on, man? How you doing? How you feeling? Thanks for the introduction, Don. No doubt, brother. I'm feeling great, man. We just finished off a couple of great weeks of comedy with you. Oh, man, it's been man, great. opening up for Michael Collier. Yeah, it's been great, man. And last weekend with Tommy Davidson. From, yes, man. Oh, man, from, from Living yeah. Color and holy shit. Yeah, and great experience. T- and two weeks on the cruise ship? Yeah, That's what I want to hear about. Yeah. Mm. Two weeks on the cruise ship, man. Did did uh, eight shows within two weeks, four shows each week. It's a great experience, man, uh, doing a little trial run for Carnival Cruise Line, yeah. uh, 15 minutes per show, and uh, I go back again in April and everything goes right, they'll sign me for a year contract. And that's oh, no rowboat, shit. right? Holy shit. Nah, it's no uh, rowboat. That's the big one. We're talking like, <laughs> no, this is <laughs> ship line in here, right? Hey, what kind of buffet benefits are included with that? Oh, right? man, they come. the buffet benefits are great, man. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'll yeah. sing for some chicken. Yeah, man. I brought back the fat boys, believe mm-hmm. me, you can believe that. <laughs> I see. Great time, man, we had a great time, man. We had a great time on that ship, man. But it's been a great year. Uh, I think it's been a great year for all of us, actually. You know what I mean? And we got things we're looking forward to in 2023. Uh, I know we got a couple shows on the horizon, Al and myself. And uh, Rico is doing great with his photography business and uh, makes us all look great. The headshots are great at what he does. And uh, and then we, uh, we'll we talk about it a little later, probably in some uh, future episodes. We got some nuptials. Yeah, <laughs> right. I, I'm presently on my way to being ordained for that one. Save oh, the date, baby. Oh, yes. He's doing it. All right. Well, then, the ladies and gentlemen, you heard it first here. I'm yeah. officially the bridesmaid. He's right. Right? Yeah, he's been asking to be the bridesmaid. You know I'll be in style. Oh, yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. He's going to. I already have Maid one. of honor. <laughs> right. <laughs> exactly, man. So, uh, so, so, Files, when is that date? Talk to the people seven, a little bit about seven. that. It's 7 7 23. That's 7 7 23. Why did you pick that date? Because that's the year I was born, 7 7. And awesome. seven's my favorite number. Oh. It's all about seven. Make I like drinking name. them things too, so I'll be toast to the seven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's going to be secret sevens all around. Yeah. 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 It's going to be crazy. Yeah, mm. It's going to be awesome. Al, how do you feel about that? We are meeting with a producer on Monday about making a, uh, mm-hmm. a film out of this, a documentary. Oh, yeah. that's going to be awesome. Right. Yep. That it's is going to be, be awesome. a cover charge. Mm. <laughs> we're getting a headliner. They'll be laughing in the pews, ladies and gentlemen. And we're, we're, uh, we're just figuring out a fun way to document and get a free wedding video mm. and, and get y'all motherfuckers to pay for it. That's what we're right. doing. Oh, man. Frank Starr is going to be our number one usher. He's going to oh, yeah, read no my vows. Shh. Oh, yes. No, no spoiler alert. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Spoiler alert. Oh, yeah. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. This would be the comedic wedding of the year. You can just believe that. I can just already see that's going to happen. It's going to be crazy. It's going to be ridiculous. I know. I can't wait. <laughs> I really am excited. Location to be announced soon. Oh, uh, yeah. No doubt about that. Yeah, you, can't outdress the, you can't be outdressing the bride either. Oh, nobody, yeah. but, nobody but outdress me. <laughs> and we already know Rico will be too there taking the pictures. Yeah, Ain't yeah, no telling man. what he's going to capture that day, yeah, man. man. There's no telling, the man. pictures <laughs> capturing all those moments. <laughs> all right, ladies and ladies. I almost said ladies and gentlemen, but that's another show. Ladies, I'll need a plus one. Uh, Send you your heard resumes. <laughs> well, let me. I don't think my mom's gonna like that. <laughs> oh! Busted. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Listen. Now we, so, a, now we got a whole new topic. To so, <laughs> so here's the thing. For all you that knows me, uh-huh. I have been a bachelor for quite some time. That's right. That's, you know. <laughs> but I've recently turned 55. ARP is knocking at my door, right? Uh-huh. Call now. Put your social security <laughs> number in. You could be entitled to some monies on Medicare. And I also saw a sign while I was driving the other day about these 55-plus communities. Right. I'm eligible, and I would fit right in, and I'd be the youngest That's dude right. in the neighborhood. That's right. And all <laughs> these ladies on pensions, right? Right, right. Fresh meat. <laughs> but I had to say, look, Cupid has shot me right in my tuchus right here in my front yard. Oh, here we go. And ladies and gentlemen, well, you brought it up, my hey, friend. Let's go with it. You brought it up. I just want to make sure you know everybody was, you know. The love bug is bit just Joe. Yes, sir. I didn't know she bit you. You told me. Look. Yeah, you just said y'all kissed. 
Mm. <laughs> you say nothing about biting. I'm on my way to be hypothetically Don's stepdad. Nah, Hypothetic. Nah, once I'm removed. Nah, I'm and step, like, you ain't gonna worry about that. I'm gonna step nah, over you. You know, we talk, about everybody, that. But we talked about that because I had, you know, I'm so shook up about it for days on the end. How am I gonna get through this? Do I tell Don? Do I re- be the old Joe that I used to be and just go for the good time? Call, I'm not a religious man. I called the church. I called the <laughs> rabbi. I called the fucking months in Thai, Tibet. I spoke to the CEO of the company. What should I do? <laughs> and I came with the best thing that I should have done is walk away from it. <laughs> it's the hardest thing I ever want to do. I'm not even made up my mind yet. <laughs> After having a talk with my good man Don, but you don't break the bro code, right, gentlemen? Hey, man, I hear sure. You. Right. Well, I'm talking to the wrong person over here. Right. Fucking stalker with a telephoto lens. Right. Listen. What's the bro code? I think Joe found a woman that puts the fucking scarings on him. Right? Oh, and I'm like, I'm like, look. Joe was shook up. Don's mom. He was like, I was re- violated. I, that's what I said to you, right? I said, look, man. I got to talk to somebody. I got to confide in somebody, Al. I don't oh, know what to my do. Oh, goodness, man. Dream. Jewish guy confessional. That's funny. Uh, isn't that funny? Mm-hmm. <laughs> exactly. That is funny. It don't matter what religion you are. When shit, look, people pay four ninety five a month to see movies like this shit <laughs> with these titles, yeah. right? Cougars. Yeah. A cougar got to me, man. Yeah. Once you go black, you don't go back. But once you go Vince's black, um, oh, you go. That's you, what I'm you, saying. Right? Vince's black puts you on crack. Look, you know who I right? You know me. They, they look. They that's Vince's black. They right? call me the light skinned cousin in church, right? Yeah. 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 So you know, I'm glad I have your blessing. It's all good, man. And, it's uh, all good. Man, she can you, she can be with a crazy or funny guy. You better, right, you better watch your shit, Joe. <laughs> right, right, right. Like Chica Loco, you word out to her, yo, don't cut you. <laughs> <laughs> your but, car done blew up, didn't it? Right, and I'm like, huh. Now maybe oh, I could get a job as you, as your mom's chauffeur, like driving oh, Miss yeah, Pat. Yeah, and, and I'll be have, there. Y'all have at it, you know. <laughs> Have at it, man. Have at it. I'm glad we can have this conversation across the whole universe. Do you realize that somewhere out there in the universe, NASA's going to fly our podcast out there, right? Oh, my God. Money well spent. And be money well spent. To send Explore DE in the space. Absolutely, man. Mm-hmm. And, and speaking of driving around, make sure, make sure that you go see our guy down at Colonial Motors, Inc., Right? Colonial Inc. He has three locations. Dover. Dover. Smyrna. That's it. And Townsend. Mm. That's, that's a really nice that's establishment. Man. Man. Armando Riviera. You want to make sure you go mm. see him. He'll get you in some oh, class, a oh, classic yes, car, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm Great presently car, looking at a 17 uh, Cadillac. Oh, really? Black on black. Yeah. Nice. Nice, man. Yeah, diamond in the back, sunroof top. I like that. Yeah, it's That's a nice ride. About. Make sure you go down there and see him, man, at Colonial Motors, man. Well, listen, this is how we're doing it here. Uh, Showtime Showcase with your boy Dream, my man, mm. Just Joe No T. Stay tuned about, stay tuned about my relationship problems in the future podcast, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh, my God. Man, she's a good kisser. I can only imagine. <laughs> 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 Who? <laughs> Who? <laughs> Who'd you say? Who'd you say was a good kisser, Joe? Uh, <laughs> Miss Pat. <laughs> Nancy's good too. Oh yeah, I haven't buddy. kissed Nancy yet. Oh man, mm. kissing and telling. You got tell the you. pat out of the bag. <laughs> yeah, <really? laughs> yeah, Don. Thanks for letting the pat out of the bag. <laughs> oh my God, hey Miss Pat. Well, yeah, we definitely gonna get out of here. I need a cigarette now. So listen, uh, <laughs> we're here at the Showtime Showcase with your boy Dream. We're here with the beautiful Fives, my main man Rico is in the house. Sorry. Here with the CEO of Showtime Showcase and, and your Florida boy e. Cabana Boy Just yeah, Joe. Yeah, man, we're here, my man Just Joe. Man, listen, we have a great time, man. Make sure you stay you tuned with us, ride with us as we go through season four, man. It's your boy Showtime, Show, your boy Dream at Showtime Showcase with your boy Dream, and we are out of here, man. We are out. Woo! We are, we are, we are. Oh my god, <laughs>